that makes a quorum. Welcome everyone. I'm Sharon Green Middleton, Vice President of the City Council, Representative for the 6th District and Chairperson of the Economic and Community Development Committee. We are here this afternoon for the following bill, just one bill today, 21-0109. Um, as a courtesy, please turn on your camera if you are able when called upon to speak. In attendance, we have um, the members of the committee, uh, Councilman John Bullock. Thank you, Madam Chair. Councilman Mark Conway. Councilwoman Odette Ramos. Thank you, Madam Chair. Council Member uh, Ryan Dorsey. And I'm sure other ones will come on as we move forward. Uh, we have members from the Office of the President. Um, I see Nikki Thompson, Director of Legislative Affairs. Lucy Font, Staff Assistant for Legislative Affairs. Thank you, Madam Chair. And um, representatives of the Mayor's Office, I see Nina Thimulus, Deputy Director of Governmental Relations. Thank you, Madam Chair. And from the Comptroller's Office, I see Casey Keller. Thank you, Madam Chair. <clears throat> Before we, we begin, I would like to remind you that if you are not speaking, please keep your cell phone mute. Please do not take yourself off of mute unless you are recognized. When recognized, please identify yourself and the agency or organization that, represent, that you represent. Once you have finished speaking, Please put yourself back on mute and let's begin. Bill number 21-0109, City Property Renaming Carrollton uh, Elementary Middle School to Katherine Johnson Global Academy for the purpose of changing the name of Car Carrollton Elementary Middle School located at 201 North Bend Road to Katherine Johnson Global Academy. This bill was introduced on July 19th, 2021. Uh, this bill was sponsored by Council Member Bullock. Council Member Bullock, would you like to comment about this, about the bill? Oh yes, thank you, Madam Chair, uh, for scheduling this and thank you for the opportunity. Uh, really simply, you know, this is really in line with some of the wonderful women around uh, this virtual screen in terms of female leadership, not only in, in government and public service, but also the sciences. And so we look at uh, Katherine Johnson in terms of being the, the famed uh, NASA mathematician who uh, really uh, contributed so greatly uh, to those space missions. And now that we have a 21st century school built from the ground up in um, our district, we're looking to uh, name it after Katherine Johnson as a, as a testament not only to her work, but also uh, to the opportunities for our young people in the future. So I, again, I look forward to uh, your support. And thank you again for the opportunity. Do committee members have any comments or questions at this time? Hearing none, the committee will now hear from agency representatives and we'll start with the city solicitor office. Good afternoon, Madam Chair. This is Vic Turbola from the city solicitor. We are prepared to approve the bill for form and legal sufficiency. Thank you, Victor. Uh, the planning commission. And we have, I don't see a representative from planning. We have the report, but I don't see an individual. Nina, would you like to speak on planning? Madam Chair, um, the planning will stand by the report, but I'm going to reach out if we can come back to them. I'm going to try and have somebody from their office join shortly. Yes, because they are offering an amendment that we'd like to them we would like for them to talk about um 
It's basically um, before I guess you try to get someone <clears throat> um, in lines four and continuing on to line five. They're striking 201 North Ben Road to replace with 1100 Whitmore Avenue. And in line 12, they're striking 201 North Ben Road and replace with 1100 Whitmore Avenue. And, so, and um, Madam Chair, if I'm not, I can speak to that. So uh, essentially, yeah. when the bill was drafted initially, that was an error. The appropriate address is 1100 Whitmore um, Avenue. So that was the minor uh, amendment there. So I appreciate you bringing that because we want to make sure it's reflected properly in the record. So thank you. OK. And for the committee, that amendment was sent yesterday in an in a email. So it sounds like it's more of a technical getting that street right. OK. Um, the Baltimore City Public School System. Is a representative here from the school system? And I don't see one. Okay, we'll move on to the Department of Transportation. Chair Liam Davis, Baltimore City Department of Transportation. We stand by our bill report, which is no objection. Thank you. The Baltimore City Public School System, they have a large comment, but we can do. Okay, um, I'm going to try to hold, I'll, I'll go through the other ones and then I'll just come back and just read, go over some of the comments as a matter of record from the school system, unless someone pops on. Thank you, Liam, for uh, your no objection. Uh, Baltimore City Development Corporation. Madam Chair, good afternoon. Dave Garza for the Baltimore Development Corporation. We stand by our report, no objection. Thank you. Thank you, Dave. Department of Finance. Good afternoon, Mara James, Legislative and Engagement Lead for the Department of Finance. We stand by our report. We do not oppose this legislation. Thank you. And the Department of Real Estate, CC, I mean, Casey. Thank you, Madam Chair. Um, Casey Kelleher for the Department of Real Estate in the Comptroller's Office. We stand by our report, which is no objection. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Um, just to go back for a matter of record with the Planning Commission, um, with their favor of amend amendment and approval, it says resolved that the Planning Commission vote to approve the recommendation of its department staff and recommends that City Council Bill 21-0109 be amended and approved by the City Council for the following amendments. And again, that was in lines four and continuing on to line five, strike 201 North Bend Road and replace with 1100 Whitmore Avenue. And in line 12, strike 201 North Bend Road and replace with 1100 Whitmore Avenue and that's of City Council Bill 21-0109. And uh, if any of the committee members need to talk to Eric Tiso, he's the Division Chief of Land Use and Urban Design. And then for um, a matter of record for the Baltimore City Public Schools, um, they strongly support City Council Bill 21-0109, which seeks to change the name of Car Carrollton Elementary Middle to Katherine Johnson Global Academy. Uh, the name change process for Carrollton was initiated um, with the, pro pro mm, the problematic shifts in the school as a result of the 21st century school buildings plan and to create an opportunity for the school to be named after someone who more uh, represents the background of the students and families served by the school. As a part of the 21st century school building plan, the school's grade bands have changed to serve all students in third through eighth grade in an expanded zone that includes two other school communities. 
Creating a shared identity representative of this expanded community is an important part of bringing students and families together. The school has chosen to adopt a STEM, which is science, technology, engineering, arts, and technology focus as it moves into its 21st century building. So those are some key, they really gave us a very long letter, but those are the key, uh, that's the key information from the school system. Um, does the committee have any questions at this point in this renaming? Um, I'm sure the sponsor of the bill, Councilman Bullock, can further answer any questions if you have any. And hearing none, we're now going to check to see if there is any public testimony. And okay, while we're waiting for that, um, <clears throat> I just want to mention that uh, Computer users, please use the raise hand function if you wish to testify. When called upon, please state your name. Telephone callers will be unmuted one by one, and we'll, and we'll hear two beeps. Um, if you do not wish to testify, please say so. If you do wish to testify, please state your name. We see no hands raised, and now we are checking for callers. No hands raised. And we have, I, there's someone, Shamara Thomas. Shamara, did you want to testify on this bill? Shamara Thomas. Council did you want to testify? Works in my office. Oh, okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. She had an explanation point by her name. I didn't know if she wanted to testify. What about Maggie Keenan? Maggie Keenan, did you want to testify on this bill? Okay, that's uh, another agency staff. So we have no uh, public testimony. Any questions from? from the committee and okay now I see Eric Tiso has joined us. Good afternoon Madam Chair, Tiso for the Department of Planning. Sorry we got caught in a schedule conflict um, and Ira Kwashi who staffed this item is actually recording a chat hearing uh, that's going on at the moment. Um, if you've I already heard from I our report, uh, I'll uh, happily uh, give you some more information. We just had an amendment uh, in two places to correct the address of the school so that it matches its uh, correct parcel address. And with that, the uh, Planning Commission voted to uh, recommend approval. Thank you, Eric. And I did uh, read that amendment um, for the committee and there were no further questions. So thank you for, for jumping on. Um, so yes, there is a, an amendment to consider uh, the Department of Planning's report suggests an amendment to correct the address, and we did send the amendment to committee members. Is there a motion to move the, the amendment? So oh. moved. Second. Uh, okay. Second. Conway. Thank you. Who moved that? I saw Conway Bullock. second. Bullock, thank you. Okay, this will move uh, favorably with, amend with an amendment. Chair Middleton, yes. All the, oh, wait a minute. All those in favor say aye. Of the amendment, Madam Chair? Of the amendment, yes, I'm sorry. Aye. 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 All those opposed, nay. The ayes have it. Um, now we're go again going to uh, move the bill as amended and I move the bill favorable as amended. Second. Second. Okay. So that's Dorsey and Ramos. Chair Middleton, yes. Uh, Bullock? Yes. Yes. Conway? Yes. Yes. Dorsey? Yes. 
yes Glover absent Ramos yes yes Stokes yes is a yes this bill will move favorable as amended at the next council meeting and this meeting is adjourned thank you all